storage bins, and a great company called Cupco brings them to us. And if we're talking about smart gadgets in the kitchen, then we must be talking about Mark Charles Masilli. You, my friend. See there? Very nice. Come on in. Let's welcome back Mark Charles Masilli, who is here, to talk to us about this set of two yep. set organization of two. bins. Right, my Good to see you. This is exciting because these will go in the pantry mm -hmm. or in the refrigerator. In the fridge, refrigerator, and of course, on the counter, underneath the kitchen sink, anywhere you'd like it to go. You get two made out of a durable, clear plastic. They also come with integrated already in there stainless steel. Bottle openers and they sit right there. You don't have to use them, but they come with them right there. Beautiful stainless steel. They also come with, I actually pre removed one, that there's little non slip grid uh, feet, but they actually pop off. I pre did this one to make it easier. So this can be cleaned out, dishwasher if you'd like, and they pop right back in. So nothing's going to slip on the inside or stain. And because the feet pop through, it's not going to slip on that. They also are stackable, David. They've got handles built on both sides. Let's put it to the task and show you all the different ways you can use this around the house. Let's do it. Okay, so we're going to start over here, guys. I'm going to give you a little tour. The first thing we do is pick up our favorite crafts. What I love about it, remember, it is see through, but it's very skinny. It could be put into a cabinet long wise or short wise, right? So now I can see everything in there. But with this two handle, I'm going to come around the front to show you. With this two handle, I can grab this craft and bring it with me anywhere I want to go. So there's the crafts. Have you ever, like, tried to store in your pantry everything that's got, like, uh, beans and um, mixed nuts and herbs and stuff, and they just really don't stand very well. The beauty behind this is you can actually fit a whole bunch in here, and again, organizing that pantry. Here's those little snacks, those little bars that you have all the time. Those can do as well. Come up here, and when you have everything from the mac and cheese boxes to the mixes to the soup packets to the spice packets, they all fit right in there. Again, remember, look at the skinny profile, but it's going to hold a lot and keep it all straight and you can see what you have. Take it outside of the kitchen, the pantry, and take your first aid stuff. You really need to see where all the first aid, all the different band-aids and all the bandages and stuff. Here's a way to see all that. We love that. Mm -hmm. For everybody who is a collector of all the great QVC makeup, here is something great for the countertop. Remember, look how thin and slim this is. This could be behind the vanity on the back. Or this could be under the sink yep. in the bathroom yep. and you pull it out in the morning to do your makeup. Maybe you've got three daughters that all share the same bathroom and are all complaining there's not yep. enough room on the countertop. Mm -hmm. Have everyone put their things in their own in their own shelf. Yep. And then they only pull that out when they're getting ready. And if you are the soccer mom or the class mother or you're in charge of those those kids' snacks, you have every juice box from the box to that squeezable bottle to those bags. And here's a way to keep them all neat and organized, not falling over in the fridge or out of the fridge. Okay, so let's go to the fridge real quick. You okay, and I. let's on. do that. And how many gone now, Sean? 200 gone in this okay. show. So now for the month, 3,900 ordered. What I love about it also is vegetables and fruits. Realize what I talked about, it, this being stackable, folks, okay? Over here I have, I'm going to take this out and show you. Here's all my citrus. Look how great the citrus is. I can see it all. I can stack it all in there. Wonderful. But what I did with the other one, David, I took all my carrots. This could be celery sticks, zucchinis, carrots, and sit right that. Remember, I was able to stack them. So not only keeping them all nice and fresh, I'm also stacking them, taking up the space nicely, and nothing's going to get lost in the back of that veg drawer. So great for veg, right? David, something I showed you last time that I had to repeat again because you said you really love the idea was go into that refrigerator drawer, right? I have ketchup, mustard, mayo, ranch dressing, and barbecue sauce, right? These five items I'm These now going to put. These are the kitchen essentials. The kitchen essentials. I'm going <laughs> to put them in here. I love it. Put them in here, right? Now, first and foremost, I cleared out my whole refrigerator drawer. But think about this now. Everything is in this nice skinny profile. If you're having a barbecue or you're having a picnic or you're doing something outside. Or a big family I, dinner. I can grab everything and put this on the table, outside. Remember, with the two handles, everything comes out at once. You're not taking bottle by bottle by bottle. So think of that for olive oils and vinegars and spices and things like that. So I love that. And then, of course, it was made for sodas, David, and I think that's why this the the great um, bottle opener was put in there because now you can actually find it you can hook it on the outside over here and have to be able to open that and the other thing you and I both loved is if you are a cheese fan and cold cuts it's a way to hold all the cold cuts and even in the deli bags straight up so you can see them they're not getting smushed they're not getting lost 
I'm a big fan of these little uh, these little round um, cheeses, and they're great to not fall around all over the refrigerator. It's really fantastic. Right? Now, these are not designed for the freezer. They are no. designed for the fridge. For the fridge, And yep. you're going to have great opportunities for organization, both in the fridge, in your cabinets, on the countertop, mm -hmm. because if you've got spices or those little packets of seasonings. Everybody's got those packets, Oh, my David. gosh, they're impossible. They're everywhere. I buy the taco seasoning in those yes, little packets. Yes, so do I. And they're super hard to store. Yep. Maybe you're buying bottles of water, real glass bottles. Or little smart, uh, little small snack bottles, mm -hmm. uh, 12 ounce soda cans, or alcoholic beverages, whatever you got in the fridge, and you're looking for ways to store everything because you know what? I've got more storage space in my kitchen than I know what to do with. Said no one Said ever. Said no one ever. <laughs> yeah. No one has it's extra true. storage space. Everyone's looking to maximize the storage yeah. space they have. Even something like this, like David and I both have, like the hot cocoa packets, the oatmeal packets, all of that, they're, they're in these boxes, right? I don't, especially if you get the multi-pack, you don't know where the flavors are and all that. Take them out of here and watch this. Look what I did here. There they all standing up. So it's whether it is the spice packet David was talking about, to the soup packets, to the hot chocolate, to the oatmeal, all there. And by the way, when I'm done, look at this. I can actually keep seeing all the flavors and when I'm done ready for, and you can actually sort this now, way. Or this way. If we can shoot it overhead, yeah. I want to give you some ideas of measurements because a lot of you are thinking, will this fit in my cabinet depth wise? Yeah. Okay? So this is 16 and th uh, th uh, 16 .3 inches yep. from front to back. The width on this is 3.3 .3 inches, the height is 4.3 inches. So again, from front to back, 16.3 inches. So a little over a foot deep, a foot plus four inches and change. So yep. if you're measuring inside your kitchen cabinet to see if it's going to fit depth wise and your cabinet door will still close, that's good information for you to have. And now, remember, they are stackable. If you need to stack them, you just got to make sure that whatever you put in here is not higher than the, correct. the walls. Now, let me also tell you that this is two easy payments of $9.99. Use your Q card tonight. It can be four pay. Let's also remind you that this is our only order of 2019. So it's important for you to get yours while the getting is good. And why not? Go back to school and back to autumn yep. with more kitchen organization. And you know what? Here's the fun thing Dave and I are going to tell you. You organize your kitchen, your fridge, or your cabinets, you're going to find more space for your stuff. So this is not only going to make your life a little saner, it's actually going to gain you some space. If you uh, organize your spices, you'll cook with better flavor too. True story. Because you'll find spices you forgot you had. <laughs> and you'll use them. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> hey, we're going to check in with Allie, who is in the cook nook. Hashtag cook nook. Is it a chat cook nook? <laughs> hey, I want to give you a little sneak peek. One of my favorite items in the kitchen is a spurtle.